Okay, this is 4 March. I've just arrived at my campsite and just leveled out my trailer. And uh, so it's ready to go. Now I'm going to do a walk around the camp and uh, see what I can see as, any, as far as any sign goes. Uh, like I said, today is 4 March 2013. Uh, it is starting to get a little bit later. It's about 4.35 o'clock. But it'll get dark in here. Okay. It looks like it, uh, the deer went basically that direction. Across the creek. Okay, I'm not very far from the camp. And uh, something has really tore up this area. Uh, you know, pushed the, the leaves out of the way and did some grubbing, looks like. An awful lot of it. Uh, I don't see any footprints. Of course, this could be turkeys or possibly. Um, squirrels, <laughs> lots of squirrels, because <laughs> it's been really busy all the way up there. That little bush up there is just tore up. So, over here behind these trees and down this way, over there by that big tree, it's uh been very busy in here. You have very, very active squirrels or a whole lot of turkeys or something like that. It's a little bit early for bears. You know, I you know you could be a bear looking for grubs and stuff, but no uh, no paw signs of any bears. More digging. Lots of digging. It's pretty steep too. More digging. All of that nice little area out. More digging up that way. Okay. I may have found the culprit. Just was doing all the digging. I'll zoom in a little bit here. Looks like we got some very big turkeys in here. So they've probably been, uh, you know, looking for bugs and roots and stuff. Kind of like what chickens do. I'm going to go down here and check the creek out. Alright, right over there is some very fresh deer and turkey. Now you can see that turkey print right next to the deer. And that's no small deer track. So you can tell that the turkey is, is a humongous bird, really. to lose my light so this camera is having a hard time keeping up with the, with the focus. Looks like we got a pretty good sized raccoon walking through the mud. Looks like he might be following the herd of turkey. Or he just might be working his stream way up the stream looking for food to eat. Well, I've done a complete walk around. This is the last camp to look at. Uh, I have not found any sign of anything that could be remotely construed for a Bigfoot. 
but that's what you do a walk around for so that if something does come into your camp or nearby your camp and you happen upon the footprints you'll know about when it happened so there's still a little bit of snow on the, the ground and it is getting kind of cool so I guess I'll head back and get me a sweatshirt